So the next thing that you'll have to do is install the wheel. So when, when we ship these to you, um, if you're like, this video is for, if you're buying the, the wheel kit after you bought the groomer, um, you'll, this is another part that you'll have to install. So if you notice on the rim, this, this part goes out and on the flip side, this part goes in. So valve stem goes out with these here. You got your nut, which is tapered. The tapered part goes towards the rim. So this flat side will face out and the tapered side will go into the rim. So it's very important when you put these on because they're, they're not self-centering. Uh, some car wheels, they'll have a self-centering hub that it fits exactly on. These are not. So as you can see, it can move. So just finger tight them. And you'll see, you, I have these two just finger tight that this is now center. So what that does is that centers the hub up so that it doesn't do this and so that it um, so that each nut tightens itself uh, properly on the rim itself. So you'll tighten those to 100 foot-pounds of torque or with an impact just to a good crank on it and they won't come off. Uh, make sure you check your air pressure and your tires so that you're not blowing them. Um, this system here uses a DOT tire unlike our old system that was um, a lighter duty. Um, these wheel kits are still not designed to go down the road. There's no spring in it, so every bump you hit is going, going to really jam it. Um, but it will allow you to travel at a very low speed um, and, and still be able to get to your destination. Okay, thanks.